You alright? This is Yorkshire ASMR and I would like to welcome you to Townscaper. Now Townscaper is a, a game in the loose sense of the word I guess where you just kind of muck about and build a coastal or I guess more so island village or town. I guess theoretically you could play and place enough to make a city if you wished. I uh, This is something I built last night and I just want to quickly talk about I guess the game in general because I learned about it, I don't remember exactly when, and I'd sent it to Allison as a video idea and at the time it was still in early access we waited for a full release and it released in this 1.0 version a week or two ago and I also made a video and I didn't think too much of it because I didn't think I would like it just there wasn't like a, to me a whole lot of game there I find myself struggling with games that are aimless if that makes sense like when I used to play Minecraft I would give myself a project but if I ever satisfied the project or whatever I'd stop playing because I just get bored and Arzen said to me that I should try this for like 10 minutes she said just give it 10 minutes if you think and then last night I spent like 50 minutes and the time flew by like I had no idea I had spent that long playing and this is the little town that I made it started out over here and the first thing I really built aside from a few little houses already was this little courtyard which I like to think of like as I don't know, like a priory or something and then I built in this you see this like odd star shape there's one here and that's where I built my azure tower the tallest tower in the town and I'm keeping it that way that's interestingly shaped building <laughs> and then over here I like to think of this as like a college or school it's got like multiple little pastures inside and all these interesting tiers and then the tower here faces out to sea I hate to think about any kids falling out of these windows I've actually just noticed there's post boxes there <laughs> it's interesting and then I went off on this side and I started expanding this way I left this here because I thought it was like an interesting little bit to walk out and then I had no luck of boats coming in and I kept going I like this like a little arched house that leads down to what I built as like a very bustling part of the town like look how narrow that is <laughs> you don't get much sunlight I don't think all these birds collected on this row as well and I like how like if you build them one like wide but connect them you get like interesting roofs that change in height so it's not quite so uniform it's a bit more organic and I built out down here and there's like a little fence here I don't know maybe some rich person's house or maybe like a hotel or something all these little tiny houses leading around you got one here that isn't an arch it's more of a modern it's like this industrial kind of platform but I managed to build so we got the first row of these bungalows I say bungalow they're all next to each other I don't think that counts it's adorable little steps going up here I got the second row leading to a new set of houses. 
I made them two stories, so maybe they're a bit pricier. But I think this little walkway is just adorable. Maybe these are like shops on the other side. And these people live down here. Maybe. And then obviously a tiny little row there, maybe. Shops and houses on the bottom and top respectively. And then I like the idea of getting little canals going through, so I kept some of these little those little ditties going in. And this very interestingly shaped house. I think this might be I don't know, some government house. Same with this, this tower here. Maybe some of the people who work out on the waters or work to keep the canals clean or something. They work out of these buildings. Oh yeah, I just kept building. That was an interesting little spot. So, you've got these houses here, they're too tall. I managed to get a little set of stairs leading up to like a small, tiny little raised walkway here. I don't know what the purpose of it is. I feel like if you lived here, you don't have so much noise going on all around you. Who knows? And then here I built like a bit more like a European style courtyard. So you got like a courtyard in the middle, but all these, there's like a row house here on the top, a row on the bottom, and then here's a separate house. God, it must be a nightmare. Like, if I, imagine if you lived in this bit, right? And you gotta get all the way out, you gotta walk all the way around. Same goes for down there. And then for this white house here. I don't know. Maybe another. Maybe there's, I don't know. An island purpose to it. Anyway, yeah. That's what I built for my first little. Little town. And I thought. I'd just start over. So let's do it together. This. Is Townscaper. And it's, I don't know, like relaxing in the sense that there's no aim, which I thought I'd bounce off. There's no achievements, no, actually there might be steam achievements, I don't know. But there's like nothing forcing you to do anything, you can just do whatever you want. And all you do is you click, you set the foundation. And then depending on the colour you've got, so let's go red. Just pop something down. And you can keep going. And the shape of houses changes contextually based on what's around it. So here, single tower, interesting roof, right? Changes completely into a bit more of like a, a rustic house. If I go again, it doesn't change that much, but still. It looks considerably different. We can just serve it so quickly, just remove stuff and see what it looks. So I think what I'll do is, oh that's adorable, I think I'm gonna definitely put a tower here, just because of how weirdly shaped this tile is. Look at that. What is the point of it? I don't know. But I love it. So what I think I'll do, oh that's a shame, I wanted to keep it, it's like, I wanted to keep like a water way going through it. Maybe if I do like that, there we go, that's better. And then if I go here with it, nope, that's good. Let's put some more houses down here, tell you what. That's an interesting shape. Such a weirdly shaped house. <laughs> That's a bit better. Yeah. A bit better. I don't think I'll do anything else to that one. I reckon what I'll do is I'll build a, a row here. small houses and then they connect up like that adorable I love it and they're all facing into what I want to have in the middle of the canal here like this and 
the opposite side. I'll connect it up. Let's put a. Uh, if I do that, well, <laughs> spook the birds. Sorry, birdies. I'll have a long one there. Maybe this will be a bit nicer on this side. Houses that are a bit bigger. But it's a shame they don't connect up. You know? You know what? I might scrap my idea. See, that's so much better. I think, at least. That bit didn't quite connect, but oh well. I just like the idea of. I don't know, just building things and seeing where I go with it. I don't really have much of a rhyme or reason to doing what I do. Oftentimes I'm just experimenting. And this is our first little row. Where should I go from here? How about this? We'll do another bridge connection here. Oh, you know what? No. I like that. Such a tiny walkway. <laughs> and we'll put a bigger, a bigger house here. Shall we? Let's make it like an L. Set this road so it goes out like this. Nah, 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 nah. I want to have this be another set. Oh, do I? Do I? No, I'm going to do this. I want to put houses on the back of them. Oh dear. I don't know if I want that. Do I? Do I want that? If I get rid of that, it keeps it. Which is interesting. It is interesting. But how do you get up there? That's the problem. You know? Like if I... Change things a bit drastically, doesn't it? So I mean, this game just kind of like, oops, you just kind of piddle around with it and see where it takes you. I don't quite have everything down just yet. Like, I don't know the best way of making a walkway up there. I have to go to mess around until I find it. Nah, see? None of us doing it. Oh, tell you what though. Absolutely pointless. How do you get up there? You gotta crouch your head by quite a bit. But I like the idea of it. Maybe if I make this... No. So right now the implication is that whoever lives here has access to this entire patio. Is this a patio? I don't know, whatever. But it isn't quite what I want. Well, that's not right. So I'm doing a colour picker. We'll keep it like that. So maybe these are a bit nicer houses because they're facing out to the water. And these are a bit cheaper because they're facing in. Hey, what do you reckon? I think I might do the same back here. 
in the name of I don't know symmetry so what should we have one thing I do wish this game would have oh, bugger. is a uh, like a randomized color picker right I just want Oh, I forgot what I was doing dinner. I didn't even learn. I, I want to just like, get a random colour. Let's make this a... Uh... Hmm. You see, in previous times when I built, like... I don't know exactly how I managed to get some of those like really cool walkways. Like if I copy that, how exactly did I get up there? Maybe no. How did I do it? I'll tell you what though, I don't mind that. What color did I have that house? Yeah, I think it was this colour. I'm gonna make this tower taller. I'm gonna get rid of this house. I don't want it anymore. Even if it is interesting. I want this tower to be this edge of the edge of the town. Alright. I like it. I like this little house too, I feel like. One of the nicest plots in the in the space. I'll tell you what though, maybe I could do something around here. Get another one. Yeah, I'm gonna have a No not I wanna get a white build in. Oh and then sometimes you get to spawn these little like Washing lines across places. I think that's well cute, that. Alright. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to build something. Oh, can I do what I did before? How exactly did I get it? Do I like that? I did like that. <laughs> I got a house with a door leading directly to that one street. That must be so annoying. See, I, I don't want. I want the water to move through like a canal. So, yeah, I, I'm, I'm alright with that. Alright, so now I'm gonna build something bigger. Oh, that's definitely gonna get something. Alright, what colour should I make this? Blue brown. So I've well Alison told me how to do this, but if you oh yeah. I love these star ones, they're so weird. So oddly shaped. If you fill up an entire spot like this, that is cute, but you have a little garden made inside. You know what, I'm going to make it an awkwardly shape. Not a perfect square. I'm going to keep making it weird. For a reason. Will that count? I love it. It's 
it's so oddly shaped and there's only this tiny little walkway to get in. Although I guess I could do one here too. Why not? And then maybe a tower in the middle. Nah, nah. Keep it like a small little house. And it builds these small walls in there too, so you can see. Nice little garden. Maybe this used to be, I'll tell you what, let's build this a bit bigger. Maybe this used to be the fort. And it's been repurposed. Ah, oh, no, it's too tall. I changed my mind, I'll tell you what, I can just slip, slip. awkward buildings. I can still say it used to be a fort, but maybe it wasn't a very big fort. And now it's like, um, I have no idea. Some sort of gardener's paradise. Maybe it's a bunch of small apartments. Or like condos or whatever. And everyone shares this garden. I'll tell you what though, I think that's adorable. I love creating these little waterways. It makes it feel much more. I don't know. I keep saying organic, but I keep I can't keep relying on the word organic to explain what I mean. I feel like this is the kind of place you'd go to and you just get to walk around and enjoy it all. I find myself creating a lot of things that are very thin. They kind of sneak along. You know? No, that's not going to work. <laughs> that's cute. Pointless. I guess. But cute. See, so yeah, because I keep making stuff that, like, snakes along. Maybe I should go out. You know? You know what? Change my mind. I'm gonna do that thing here and have like oh, the same color as that. I don't want that. Oh. What should I do? I'm trying to think about what I want. It's wacky, but you'll see what I mean in a second. <laughs> Imagine living here, both sides of this canal. <laughs> what would be the point? I've got no idea, but I think it's kind of cute. I guess technically green has access to the, their roof. It's a bit odd. This house is like way better than that house just by that access. I guess they could climb out the window. But onwards. Should I connect these as well? 
tell you what, I'll let them keep that access because I'm going to do, oh, I don't know the same color, let's do red. <laughs> These houses make no sense. Like imagine if like this is where your living room is and that's where the bathroom is. Upstairs, go across, get in. You'd just be annoyed, wouldn't you? Alright. Let's build this bit out a bit. I wanna have people like walk around like this. So we put a uh, I don't want to keep this walkway because I want to make a I don't know what color should I do blue <laughs> what is the point of that what is the point of it oh my god that's even worse nah get rid of it get rid of it I don't like that I made another L shape like that one. There we go. A bit different. But I like the idea of it connecting into this little X. Oh, you know what? No, I don't. I changed my mind. It's too organic. Not too organic. Too, like, pre planned. You know? There we go. That's better. I do here. Let's do uh, a row of houses. All the different shades. Why are they not connecting up? if I get one more. It's odd that they're not bunching up, but... It is what it is. That'll do. A nice little row there. And then here... I'll put some big houses. I want to make a four house. Oh dear, what have I done? There we go. Whoops. How's that look? Mm. Bit too neat. Oh, that looks weird. That looks a bit better. I like that. It always feels like this, but just got chopped off for no reason, but that's fine. We can live with that. And we'll build something else here. What exactly? I don't know. Yeah, I've got an idea. Like long, thin houses like this. Like this is the nicest house because it's like the corner lot. And it's much bigger. I just realized something. <laughs> There's no door. There's no door. <laughs> they have to get up <laughs> the river to get to their, their house. That doesn't... That's not right. Somebody fix it. Oh, what am I going to do? I don't know what to do about it. <laughs> I guess I'll just leave it as is. How about this? 
of them. I'm just giving them a bigger pie. Yeah, I was trying to give them a bit of a bigger house to be nice to them, but it's not working. All right, fine. We'll settle with that. I've done barely anything compared to Mars Town, haven't I? I don't even know what I've been talking about. Have I been talking about anything in real particular? I think... Um, I guess that's what the joy of this game comes down to. It's just like... Piddling around. Seeing what works, seeing what doesn't work, what you like. What can you do differently? Like if I was going to be a bit more analytical about it, at least... The, from an architectural standpoint, you'd be building it so the sun, as it rises and sets, would have different effects based on where you are in the town, right? Because you want to make sure that some, like some of these narrow streets I've made, gets a bit more sunlight or something. I'll tell you what, I changed my mind about that house. Oh yeah, I love these. Like, I'm off the mind to make a tower. Because they look so goofy. Yeah, I tell you what. I can make the white tower. But I like this one though, it's so skinny. So needlessly skinny. I'll keep this one like this. And, uh, what else should I do? I think over here, I'm going to build more of these. How do you get up there though? Like, I can only suspend my disbelief to a certain degree. i got to figure out how to fix that. Like. How, how do they get up there? That fixes it. Gives them a nice little house on that street. Oh, I've broken it again. Oh. I want to make some more of these, like, Rose. I tell you what, that's a nice house. Look, you get access to the sea and through the front. Oops. I don't know how last time I managed to build the little, um, second tier. I'll have to tinker around see if I can redo it. But I did like the look of it. But once you achieve greatness the first time it's so hard to replicate it. And maybe on this side of the road. We have a few doubles. I do want some way of getting up there, but how exactly to do it, I do not know.
Sorry, birdies. playing this game. <laughs> it's just an excuse for me to keep playing it or something. Let's call something interesting down here. What exactly? I don't know. Maybe like little row of shops or something. Sense they're gonna go across like that with the strength in arches, alright? Remember that. Strength in arches. I feel at this point, what I definitely want to try and do is figure out that tiered system. And I managed to do it last time, and I don't know how. I've got no idea how I did it. Maybe if I build up the back of these, let's have a go figuring it out. So, if I copy this here, it keeps it, but if I make a new colour, alright, wait, is that all the same colour? So they're a bit different, and then I go up. Now, how do I get a leveled system? something I actually build like it organically creates itself so why exactly did that I guess because of this connection I mean, I guess it's not bad, right? They've got like this little patio up here, and they can share it too. And then maybe these are like, actually, hold on a minute. There's no bloody door. Yeah, maybe these are like shops. this bit separated it's not quite as pretty it's a bit more industrial looking oh bugger 
There's no door there again. How about that? Oh, there we go. So, they can get out of here. They can get out of there. Nice little scene spot. Shop down here. They can have a shop there. Sorted. There you go. Deliveries can get loaded up there. It's not quite how I did it though. Maybe I gotta think longer. Maybe I gotta be just a bit longer than what I've been doing so far. Alright. Oh, excuse me. Alright. Where would be a good place for more shops? Maybe right here. Alright, so. And we'll connect here and here. <laughs> it's adorable. It's not what I want, but it's adorable. Keep this little waterway flowing. I don't want it to be blocked. I guess it's not super pretty, but let's see if this can go that way. Because <laughs> I'm gonna about to build a bunch of stuff here. set a flat ground but now the question is how do they get up like last time I don't exactly know how I did it right here. Ah, God, it's messing with my brain. I managed it somehow. But how? Oh. I don't know why that does it, but it does. It managed to say, all right, so if I do this, brilliant, there we go, I'm going to make this even taller, more, yeah, I think it might be a bit taller than that one, but it's all right, oh, that's lovely, that's exactly what I wanted, I guess I could keep doing it, right, nah, because that's going to lock this one out. Even though they don't, they don't all get doors down here. Oh well. I'm not sure why that did it. Like, is there something there for me to delete? Yeah, but what is it? What it's like? Those are the two actual houses, but somehow it's created this 
based on this space. Like there's like two between these two towers. Maybe that's it. Alright, maybe I can keep going then. Let's go down here. Oh, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. No way, it's not gonna work. <laughs> I guess we'll see. Bridge. I want to bridge this gap. Oops. You know, I want to. I want to bridge that little spot. How best to do that? Like theoretically, you could pay to go through. It's unnecessarily tall, but I kind of like it. Alright, so it seems to be... If I make one of these a tower... This house has no door. There you go. So it has to be, so there's got a, like at least one space between them, and that's when it does it. Bad for like, anyone who lives in the middle, though, because like it's gonna be much noisier in it. little row with like a little adorable walkway between them. Let's get rid of these. 
these. That'll do. But now I think right here I've got to build something massive. So I built a brown thing over there. Let's build something green. Oh yeah. What are the weird shapes we got? Oh. I love these odd shapes. Like that's definitely gotta be something. Oh no, get rid of that, get rid of that. That's even weirder. <laughs> This is your entryway. Even bigger. Making it bigger. It's a shame it doesn't turn this into a green, even with this. You know, I've got to like. little shed right here. I'm mean, like maybe you're supposed to think about what are the point of some of these buildings, but it's like does it really matter, you know? I guess I don't need to come up with an answer for them. I could if I wanted, but I'm not gonna. That's great. I love it. And it's like, are these bridges? Not really. <laughs> Just get some people, watch people going down these stairs. What I really wanted, what I really wanted was like an overhang walkway. Where you could walk under here and over there. And I think what I need to do is get go bigger. I just don't know if they'll build these any higher. You gotta like tear it, right? And like this walkway and then another walkway and that next level. Maybe. Yeah, see that doesn't do it. Oh well. Alright, what else do I feel like we're missing? Oddly shaped ones. It's called brown. It's an oddly shaped house. A nice house though. Good real estate. Look, these are the shop fronts. You know, like a bunch of little housing blocks. Fancy tower. Another fancy tower. I'll tell you what we should build. Like a hotel or something, right? Where should we build it though? Let's fill the coming off here. Oh. it missing oh there we go look at that door that is a fancy hotel door right there if I get rid of the, oh no 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 we need the hotel door we need the hotel door but what I can do 
is I can I feel like I can do this and give it like a nice little garden inside so like this is where like the rooms are for people staying and then like staff and facilities are all back here and then the guests can stay out here while they visit the town I don't know what the point of this is though nah like an exclusive entrance towards the shops and this is where you come to get your bags dropped off definitely Ah, uh, I prefer like I like having the water go through it and I can't get that I guess I might do with this your boat could come up here, drop you off right at it. That'll do. The Velvet Hotel. That's what it is. So I've been playing this for like an hour now, judging my recording, and yeah, I get that I spent only like five, ten minutes talking about my past island. It doesn't look like I've done very much. But the time's like flown by, at least for me. I guess because I haven't been talking that much. I've been kind of lost in what I've been doing. There's just something really common about this game. It's, uh. I, I mean, I say game so loosely because it's like. There's no aim or objective other than like self gratification. You just kind of do what you feel like doing. You mess about with like, you know, how the tiering system works. You build funny little towers here and there. You know what, I wanna fix this tower. Speaking of towers. There you go. Free run of you. Oh I like that. What if I do that? No. Nope. Don't like that. Beautiful. And like the game's so colourful. Like I get like I'm the one choosing the colours and I'm usually just choosing randomly. There's not a lot of rhythm or reason to why I do the colours I do. Like I picked this one because I wanted it to be like an old fort or something. But these two I don't know, just just random. And like this one, I think because I like the the orange tiles, roofs, which is like quite Mediterranean. It's got a nice clash with the white. It reminds me of Florence. I think maybe that's why. I don't know what it is they use in their paint, but Florence, at least in my memory, had a lot of white and orange. What else can I fix? I should really stop. I've been going for an hour now. Give it a rest, Robert. I think this is alright for now. I'll leave it as it is. I'll tell you what, though, some people have made some crazy stuff. Like they filled out a huge portion of the map. Like a huge portion. And then did this thing to make it all green inside. So it looked like, like a castle with like a huge farm on it. Which I guess theoretically I could do. Maybe like the... The farming grounds of the... Uh, yeah, oh. Like, how big do you. How, how big do you reckon I gotta be here? I say this, like, if you built a farm at sea, you'd need some really good system for water treatment because you got so much salt water 
such a weird shape. Whoops. Uh, I guess we build a green one. What should we have? We had a brown one. Let's go for this like plum looking colour. No oh, bugger. I keep pressing the wrong colour there. Uh, Burn. Oh, I do wish this game had was like, I want to like, fill all this, otherwise i got to click each and every tile. I want to leave that because I want like, I want to leave the water going through. Which I guess is another idea to like build like around a small spot of water. So you create like an artificial lake. I say lake. A sea lake. Because it'd be salt water. But still. Alright, nearly done, nearly done, nearly done. So. <laughs> I love these. I'll, go, I'll, I'll do. I'll do this. So you'll see in a second when it's when it's done. Also, too hard an angle. No. Oh, whatever. That'll do. There we go. And then I can have. Oh, look at that. Adorable. What are the weird shapes that we have in here? I love the. Yes. The tower. I'll give it like a base. Amazing. Yeah, I don't love that one so much. How about that one? It's almost like making a maze. I don't want it to create so many. Whatever, two will do. Nah, I'll keep it low like that. It's cute. So this would be like, I guess, where a bunch of food's grown here locally in the island and that feeds into the town and maybe a bunch of people work on this farm jobs, see, I just create jobs right here employment well yeah, this is my uh, my run through a townscaper and you can go here and you can change where the sun is and maybe I can get some of the golden hours yeah, somewhere around here. So just like a sleepy little town. You got some shops, some uh, historical buildings, some interesting paths to walk through. Maybe even you could use like gondolas through the uh, canals. It's nice, isn't it? Well, if you've watched this all the way through, I hope you enjoyed this, even though I wasn't talking here and there. <laughs> I just got lost played the game. And uh, I'll see you next time. Maybe it won't take me six months to do another video. Alright, ta-ta. Good night.